Now, last year we reviewed the battle ready putters, which I have in my hand. This year we have the battle ready two putters. Now, as you can see already, slightly different head cover designs, but still with 26 as a little nod to Bob Parsons for his service in the Vietnam War. We're gonna put these head to head and just compare the differences and see the upgrades which they've made in the latest generation. So just a quick reminder, if you're new to the channel and enjoying the video, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe and hit that bell so you get the notifications when our videos go live. Brandon's here and I've got Black Jacks here. Very clean on the eye, the new one. Love the coloring, a little flip slip reverse you can see the faces battle ready to brandon is now black with the little kind of pyramids on the face have gone gray the, obviously the body is now gray if we look at the bottom we've got obviously the weighted designs here as well little kind of tugs in at the back too if i go into our black jacks completely different in color as well really visually very pleasing on the eye with the brand new one they're just so well balanced if we look on the bottom not not too much difference, pretty much exactly the same in terms of design, but just the coloring sets it apart. But internally is where they really have changed. They both are hollow body constructions. Now they're injected with polymer. Because the faces are the thinnest PXG I've ever created, it's gonna help and improve MOI, feel, consistency as well off the face. Now they've also got an aggressive milled face, so they've re-improved or redesigned and made that pyramid face even better through their milling process. We're gonna do Brandon against Brandon 2.0. Brandon first, just to familiarize myself. Time for the battle ready too. Oh, that's so solid. You can actually feel the polymer injection supporting the thin face because it is so solid and crisp. The acoustics are great. I'm gonna hit this a little bit off the toe. Like even, even that, it's still very, very forgiving, even in a blade. And obviously I've got the M16 shaft in here too, but first impressions are very, very good. Great roll, great feel, great sound. So I'm gonna hit a couple with the blackjack just again to get a familiarization again. That's just, that's, it's a lot softer. The Blackjack 2.0. That feels so good. That rolls so well. So well balanced. I hit pretty much every single putt exactly the same. It's very consistent, feels great, rolls great. We're gonna do Brandon versus Brandon 2.0 again, but we've got 20 feet this time. I'll start off with 2.0. Oh, oh, that one just took a little bubble. How did that not go in? That literally started left of the hole and just said, I'm gonna turn right and I'm gonna wave at the hole. The Battle Ready 2, Brandon, is, is superb. It looks great, it feels great. The plumber neck as well, the way it frames the ball at dress, you just feel like you're gonna start everything online. Feels great in the hands. The grips, grips fantastic as well. I like everything about it so far. We've got the Brandon, the original Battle Ready. See, this one just feels slightly softer. It, it does jump jump off the face. It's a better, better strike. Battle of the Blackjacks, battle ready, Blackjack 2 in hand. The wings on it are, are, slight, are slightly thicker. If you kind of look here, I just like how it, it feels a little bit larger in terms of profile. Kind of shove that one a wee bit. is just really good. Oh, hit it. I like the coloring. It, it suits my eye that little bit better and I feel like I can just glide it straight back and straight straight through. OG Blackjack. Oh, it's gonna go in the hole. Yep, it's gonna go in the hole. Like it's nice and easy to, Jesus Christ, more solid, but that's actually a really hard putt. If I was gonna choose between the two, 
I would choose a new one. I just, the about ready to black jack. I just like the way it looks at a dress. The coloring's fantastic. But what we're gonna do now is we're gonna hit them from 10 feet. I'm gonna choose one, which one I would, I would kind of put in my bag. Most important putting happens within that 10 foot range. Okay, it's a good start for Mr. Blackjack. Oh. Oh, just burning, burning the edge. Time for Monsieur Brandon, battle ready, 2.0. Stay high. Stay high. <laughs> Sudden death playoff, the battle continues. One ball each. Oh, there you go. How'd you like it? Straight in the middle. Brandon to take it to an extra hole playoff. Oh, he's not done it. So the winner is the blackjack battle ready to very well balanced, very easy to get that ball starting online. Both of them are absolutely fantastic. This one obviously performs for me. I really do like how this frames the ball, but the roll that comes off, that 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 new kind of refined pyramid milled face is superb. The weighting of them is fantastic. I really like the grip as well. You've got more of a, a pistol style grip on this one. And this one's kind of, you're kind of straight with a slight kind of, more of a, a flat kind of front and then rolled out the back. Sits in the hands really nicely. They're both absolutely brilliant. And with the nice addition of the M16 shaft in there as well, just giving you even more stability and consistency with your putts. What they've done with this, with the new hollow body designs, their thinnest face to date, the feel, the sound, the roll, it's just superb. And this one obviously is the one, if I was to choose to, I would put this one in the bag because from 10 feet, it's where you're gonna hold those all important putts. But yeah, the PXG battle ready two putters are absolutely superb. So just want to say a big thank you once again to McDonald Hotels and Resorts for hosting us out here today on their championship course at Spey Valley. And a big thank you to everyone who tuned in at home. If you enjoyed the video, hit that like button, give us a sub, hit the bell, and we'll see you next time.